Hello and welcome to the tavern. My name's Jay. We're gonna play. We're gonna finish up Turok. Uh, Turok one modded. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna throw a grenade in here. And you give me. Wait. Why did my head turn that way? Haha! -ha. Hey, what's over here? Okay, uh, I'm gonna go over here first. Go around. This is probably one of those things of, uh, if I had fallen. Yep. All right. What do we have in here? Shells. Box of grenades. Fuel cells. Fuel latches, just say. Fuel tank, whatever. Flamethrower. And then over here should be just be like a full health. Ultra health, but you get what I mean. And now uh, everything here should be dead. There's only health here, right? Yeah, there's only health here, which means I can just easily just go up, leave, and then be out of here. So now this is only if I make a mistake and fall down. All this is. And another armor. I swear that this game is just like, yeah, I I get the difficulty, but here's a here, here's some armor. Like, why why can't it just be difficult for the sake of being difficult? You know, like, like at least a little bit treated like Doom. What's over here? Grenades. Oh, I guess I'm using grenades. Look at this. Another tech armor. I could just do this now. Another box of grenades. Another ultra health that I don't even need anymore.
Like, I am so full on everything, I don't need anything anymore. Like, I want to use my grenades. What the fuck? Oh, that was this. Okay. More. Oh my. They just fueled me. Ultra health that I'm not gonna need. You're still alive, no wonder. Sorry, I saw a fusion cannon and I said, uh, I'm going for this thing. Okay. So there's that over there. I'm going to go see what's this over here. That's a load of shit. That's what this is. This I'm not even gonna be worried about. Another save point. I've made it to like a lot more save points than I really. Did I miss something? I think I missed something. Oh, I did. I know what I missed. off do you just you just like deserved it that like, you had it coming that's a full health that I don't need, which means I could just go for like a straight shot. Huh, I just noticed I don't have a thumper. how I just run through this shit as if like none of this fucking matters this just becomes like kind of annoying uh let's grab this. I want to see what, what what other uh, what other shit you're hiding in. Um, that's all right. I 
kind of a kind of shit. Like, so I, at this point, I am overpowered as shit. Nice. That's another... You're dead. Who the hell is shooting me? And why? Wow. Shot him at the same time he shot me. Just gonna run through it. I gotta make my make my way back there now. I'm going with quick. I'm I'm going quick too. Like at this point, I have I have not touched the assault rifle ever since ever since I got all these weapons. And that's only because only because I never needed to. At a certain point, you no longer need to touch certain weapons. And then we just kind of like run through here. Note the non secret. Grab all this. Re grab this. Uh, go with take the flamethrower again. Got me this armor. Hey, look, a box of grenades. And a thumper. Um. Start thumping. That like that. That grenade's gonna stay there. I am going back for the grenades. I am now going back for a lot of everything else. Oh, so you probably are hearing a dog right now, and that's my uh, roommate's dog. I don't know why they're, they're barking right now, or why he's barking. Should be one more enemy. And now we can just like lay waste to everything. Alright, cool. Uh I see the machine gun. Alright. And that should be everything.
Ah, ok. Uh, let's go. I'm. Uh, I'm not. I'm not gonna say I'm sorry. I'm cycling between guns because because uh, so far a lot of the guns have just been like. I don't want to use one gun. Because uh, so the problem I have with like some games is like games kind of devolve into like uh, a one gun fits all kind of kind of scenario. And I like this a lot more. Look at that shit. That's just death. So these should these two should take me to like one monster. Let me wait for this to come down. Oh. Kind of forgot I was in the middle of a game a little bit. That's fine. Okay. So, okay, I need to go through over here. And I believe this is like the last rung of it, right? Oh my god, I have so much ammo for this shit. Why? This this poor fucking Team Rex. Seriously, this poor fucking T-Rex got fucking slaughtered. And then, yeah, Chrono Scepter piece, or Chrono Scepter, which is just, boom, weapon. Gun, gun. Weapon, weapon, weapon. This just loads me up. The backpack, backpack should come, should come first, always. Look at this shit. This fucking torture room type shit. <laughs> what? They actually made the boss a bit difficult? He doesn't die to the Chrono Scepter? All right, so how do I, how do I lower his uh, shield?
fuck? Are you serious? Okay, why is my... That is actually fucking nuts. So the Chrono Scepter doesn't kill him in one, in like three fucking shots. He better be close to death. So what is going on with that shield? And the thing is, I, I hate how all of his attacks are like unavoidable. an energy shield or oh, does it only take explosion damage I guess he only takes explosion damage. I mean, I guess that makes sense. The Chrono Scepter is just like a large scale explosion, right? Boom, done. Turok 2 modded. Killed him with a grenade launcher. What about a thumper? I should have thumped him. I guess in this fight, only explosions do work, and it's kind of annoying. And we just, like, skip to the end. Come on. Dive Studio, got it, and then, yeah, boom. There we go. Uh, what do I think of it so far? One out of ten, broken plasma, plasma rifle. <laughs> no, so I, I wish more happened with the levels aside from here's more enemies. Now, granted, it would have taken the, uh, designer like more time to uh, redo all the stages but I would like to see like periodic updates one uh, fix a plasma gun when I got that thing it, it's like it's it's worse than having no gun at all because you you get like the promise of a gun just to realize it doesn't work and I fucking hate it. Two, um, aside from like the remix level one, like if you can, 
like again over the course of time try to remix a, a couple of other stages like just over the course of time like remix stage two remix stage three stage four stage five just because just, just for the sheer fact that a lot of times adding more enemies just it, it's not it adding more enemies doesn't really mean difficult it just means I take my time and after a while I no longer take my time I just blitz through like I'm playing Doom so I would like to see like more more things with the level like make it so that the the encounter like for example all of level 8 the encounter at level 8 is I can't use the thumper you give me a lot of thumper ammo, but I cannot use the thumper because I'm in such an enclosed area that I'm going to be doing a lot more self-harm. In that regards, I then switch over to like say the plasma rifle, the uh, the, the, the plasma plasma rifle of death. Come on, think of a new name. You could just call it like a plasma cannon or something. But yeah, I'm using the Plasma Rifle of Death. I am using the uh, the M1919 Browning. I switched to the shotgun. I no longer touch the assault rifle. That became obsolescent at the moment. I got the uh, a certain gun. But realistically, like in a in a realistic sense. I would have loved more level, de like the level design for, for like the level design itself to say, "Hey, your way, your usual way of traversing an area, it, it's not gonna fly here. You ha you have to really maneuver and figure out a way." All in all, the weapons were fun. Again, just because you add more enemies, like add more like ambushes. Things like that. Kind of hard to do right now. But, it, like, add more ambushes. And just kind of, like, improve your craft. I'm not going to say I'm, like, a good map designer myself. I designed no maps whatsoever in any game. But just, just by looking at it, it's like... Yeah, I'm playing the base game with more guns and more enemies. It's just more. And yeah, they are there, there are different sized enemies with different health pools. But at the end of the day, as fun as this, this was, more doesn't really equal difficult. But like a love the like you can add in the new guns and then compensate by giving the enemies like to be a bit more like resilient. If you can make it so that they're immune to like certain weapons, that'll also go a long way. Kind of like force you into certain into certain weapons, and then kind of just like I know you can't do it because like map design, it's like enemy des enemy design. I'm pretty sure just like they they might not be able to leave. I don't know. I might I will have to touch the um, editor to see what I can do and where. But if every enemy is stuck to like a certain like to certain levels, then I think more you, you could try to like because you 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 did you did change HP values. You changed how how they operate their weapons, and you but the just again the sheer fact of adding more doesn't always mean like good. Anyways, I rambled on long enough. With that said, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I enjoyed this playthrough. Uh, I'm not going to touch Turok 1 for a while. Maybe after I beat Turok 2, ow, I will do a Turok 1 Mountain of the Sun with um, Turok 3. Because I do want to get through Turok 2 to get to Turok 3. And then from there, decide how far into Rage Wars I want to get into. 
with oh and I did get a, a suggestion to play um Tomb Raider. Like the original Tomb Raiders one, two, three remasters. So if I can get to it, I might. That being said, get the fuck out. The tavern is not closed. I shall see all you guys later.